what is up guys, today I'm doing the video that I was supposed to do a couple of days ago, uh, I kind of stalled it, um, on the film camera, which was the Pentax ME Super with an 18, no, sorry, a 24 to 85 mm lens, I think, I'm not entirely sure, I'll check that later on. Uh, I've already wasted a whole canister of film on it, just some Belford. Uh, it's not the focus that close, yeah. Ilford Pro, whatever it is, plus 400. Good fit and focus. It's good film, and yeah, I'm gonna get this developed very soon, and I'll put, I'll try and put this in its own video because I think that'd be quite cool if the photos came out quite nice. We'll see. Just started writing, so apologies for that. But this is the camera. It's the Pentax ME Super with a. It's a 28 to 85 millimeter lens. I was wrong. <laughs> obviously, um, but it's a good camera, I really like it, and it's got a really, really, really long strap, but that's good because the straps are cool, um, yeah, so, yeah, here's the camera, it's, uh, yeah, it's really good, I really like film cameras, they've got, and the quality on these photos are great, like, it takes really good photos, but it's super heavy, like, this is probably that heavier than my DSLR, I think, because it's, like, really like full metal but it is it's still really small like it's tiny I mean his Canon 50mm f1.2 which is a big enough lens a big enough prime lens it's like yeah it's not a great size comparison but it's yeah this is super heavy and this actually this lens is heavier than this whole camera but still I like it Oh, I just left the lens cap on, that was stupid. <laughs> Here's the lens. It's the Miranda. It's a Miranda lens. It's, um, as I said, 28 to 85 millimeter. It's, uh, it's a gorgeous lens. I love this lens. It's, it's really nice. I like it. Props to Miranda. It's quite an old uh, lens company, I think. But uh, it's still quality lenses, I really like it, it's, it's a glass lens as well. So here is the body itself, the Pentax ME Super, um, yeah, it's, it's a really, it's a lovely camera. I love the look of these vintage cameras, I, I really like the, like, the style of them and stuff. People call them the hipster cameras, but I, I like them. Uh, it's obviously got the winder here, shutter, that, got some winder. I haven't got any film in this by the way, so if you get annoyed with me for taking photos, it's fine, there's nothing in it. Um, but yeah, so now I'll take some close-up shots of them so you can see what it looks like in and around the camera. So that's the front of the body. That's, this is the top, this is the winder here. So that's the shot, uh, shoot button. To do it, you just have to wind it. And uh, here's the rewind button for the film. And um, yeah, I mean, in here, okay, so the back of it so to get out the film is loaded here and goes through these to the here and yeah I mean film cameras are cool man if you ever like if you're interested in photography definitely go for a film camera they're like the coolest thing in my opinion I love it um, any of you interested in photography I really recommend getting a film camera the classic, the photos on these are great, and uh, you can get a lot. Sorry, out focus. You can get a lot of stuff done, and film cameras—they're just as good, you know. Oh, I forgot to mention it's got a little timer here. Like a normal standard timer, but um, yeah, it's really cool. And uh, I really like these cameras because they're nice. Film cameras as well, they're like the best camera to uh, like learn how to do photography on. Because when you don't do very well, you have to pay the price, literally. You have to pay for the new film. So, um, yeah. Pentax. If it's a uh, like, well done video, I'm going to start doing how-tos almost on the film cameras because I love them and they're really interesting to me and they're, they're pretty cool to make a video on. Like reloading film for instance, that's like, I found that tricky, I had to, I had to YouTube it because I had no idea what I was doing but yeah, I mean 
it's really cool, I like it. Another great thing about this camera is that you can uh, fit on a normal flash, so if I was to take a photo like that, I can take a photo with a flash on it and that's pretty cool as well. Okay, so the origin behind this camera, the Pentax, is that I got it on eBay. I was going to have to pay I think, £160 for it, but I want it in an auction for £30. So I was like, whoa, this is sick and everything's working. It's such a really good camera. It's such a really good camera. It's such a good camera and I really recommend if you want to get into film photography that you get a Pentax because Pentax are sick. So thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, please share it with your friends. Remember to like, subscribe and post a comment in the comment section below what you want me to do next. Adios.